Thank you. Up next, District 2, Council Member Denise Fry. Yeah, while we're getting my slides up, uh, thank you, Vice President Chamberlain. I know you got people over here in District 2, so uh, thanks for that mention. And yeah, there are a lot of us that use that, and uh, people are actually you know, going in and doing work themselves. So we're getting some organization around what I'm calling uh, the urban forest, uh, Bremerton's urban forest and surrounding play fields that are not currently being used while our, our kids are unable to get into soccer leagues because they don't have play fields. So that's something that we're gonna be talking about. Hey, let's uh, wish Happy 20th birthday to Bremerton Ice Center. This is a gem, man, in, in Kitsap County, but definitely for Bremerton. I mean, not that many people, you know, uh, can host hockey like we can here in Bremerton, uh, as well as figure skating. You know, there, there are a lot of other things that happen on ice, but I'm a hockey fan. Um, also, hey, Mayor, love seeing the stuff about the uh, uh, more uh, uh, pathway uh, in the in Evergreen. It looked like Evergreen Lions Park. Uh, you know, I think that work is going to complete the the whole bridge to bridge walk. Uh, and uh, Josh Farley was just talking about it yesterday. All under the cause of bridging Bremerton, right? Uh, okay, moving on. Uh, uh, I've got to give a shout out, uh, uh, next slide please, um, got to give a shout out and we can move past that one too. We can get the, thank you. But I want to give a shout out to Christine uh, Grenier for, man, she has been so proactive with this lodging tax advisory committee. We had a pre-application meeting, went so well, got some great input on that. And she's also making recommendations uh, to improve the web interface and management. So just kudos to staff on that. Uh, and then, yeah, you know, I'm getting together with my pal and colleague, uh, council member Jeff Coughlin uh, of Manette, and uh, we're hosting a, uh, a public meeting. Uh, uh, please move to the next slide. Yeah, keep it on that, that one. I know the city is not used to flyers like this. I really am. Um, but this is the one that we're using, uh, at least until we get Zoom info. And Zoom info will be on the Facebook page, won't be on a printed flyer. Uh, unless it's digitized. So um, anyway, September 15th, be there or be square. Great improvements. I actually made one of my constituents cry who lives on Almira. Uh, she has kids. I drive by her house every day. There's no sidewalk. There's just a big water gully. Uh, and man, she's getting a sidewalk. Uh, uh, because of the Safe Routes to School project. So kudos, uh, Public Works, uh, and everybody that's worked on that project. We're going to be talking about it. Also, a little bit of my vision for that urban forest. And then, hey, if Council Member Coughlin has anything else to say about this meeting, I really would encourage him to do so. So that winds it up for me. Thanks, President Goodnow. Great, great segue up next, District 3, Council Member Jeff Coughlin. Uh, 